What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. So today is Tune Day. The day that we have been anticipating for a very long time. So we are just waiting on the tow truck driver to come so we can get this car on the bed and we can head out. And the tow truck has arrived. Let's go baby. Alright, let's do this guys. So we got the E85 already loaded. Everything's good to go. So we're gonna have Chris pull it up to the tow truck bed. That'll be the last time that this car has issues started. Pull it for it. So right now we're hoping that the intercooler actually doesn't hit. It is pretty low to the ground. The thing is, there is no angle on this bed. But we're hoping that it's not gonna scrape. Oh yeah, that's gonna be close. Go ahead, just go. Ah, uh, stop, 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 stop. Yeah, it's gonna hit. There's no way. There's absolutely no way. Wait, let me go get some wood. Alright, you're good. Just come, keep coming straight. You're good. You're good. We're good. You're coming. All right, you're good. Got her on the bed. Let's head out. Go ahead, man. It's getting official, like a whistle. All right, bro. So check this out, guys. Bro. 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 That's wild. This is, guys. This is not even like a month old. He needs to iron it. <laughs> <laughs> this oh fool got no bars, bro. Keep in mind, guys. He drives like 55 everywhere, and he still does stuff like. This. Jose, I'm so uh, sorry, bro. I was ordering one. I'm so sorry. It almost got your lip, basically, too. I think you could get yeah. by. It did, but you can get by. You can get by. Wow, that's so crazy. You can't catch a break. We are next in line. Man, that's scary. Kind of scary, to be honest. Alright, here we go. Looks good. Let's see what she can do. Bro, I'm so nervous. It's not even funny. Make sure we put the fuel out, bro.
All right, so we ran into our first issue. So we have to change our boost source from the turbo to the manifold, and we also got to hook up the regulator vacuum uh, to the turbo also. So that was our first pull, but of course there's more to come. Nice, nice. It sounded crazy, huh? Yeah, are the valves open? Well, yeah. They're open? Yeah. yeah. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and put this E85 in the tank. Cause that's what we're really here for, right, guys? This man is nervous, bro. I never even see him. Yeah, that, that last pull, though, was pretty solid, though. So basically, Seems this solid. is what Admin said right here. So that's the number. Top one is 381, that's with the vacuum wired wrong. And once he wired it right, it's 450. 450 on 10 pounds. On 91, it's super conservative. You could go up to like 15. Yeah. Should we put it off? Huh? Should we put it off? Yeah. 12 gallons. Straight to the 85 station, bro. Huh? Straight to the 85 station. But you still got like three bars. That's the that's the beauty of uh, bless you. Yep. So you ain't know about honey. <laughs> how, how much is it? How much gas I got? Four. Four? Dang. So it's for sure not topped off. No. <laughs> I don't know. But if you think about it, you put a lot yesterday, so 12 gallons. You added on to it. Well, no, because I I only put I was only at a quarter.
lost it. So that last pull there. Five seventy four. We're almost there. So realistically, he said it's not probably. It's probably not going to hit six hundred just because. The straw. Yeah, it's basically pushing power through the straw. This turbo is a little small. I don't know. We're going to try to push as much yeah. as we can out of it. How much? 579. 579? I mean, it is what it is. Just buy a bigger turbo. Hey, it lasted it though. Yeah. Bro. For sure. It lasted it. Mm -hmm. I was like, wait, This was cutting the line, bro. How you feel about cutting the line? You gotta <laughs> tell them up. Ah, dang. Look how sad they are. They're like, fuck, bro. They're not moving though, that's why. <laughs> Sick ass side skirt. Ooh. Told you. It is done, boys. Robert's over there taking care of his payment. Thank you, sir. Not a problem. Thank you. We is done. All right, guys. So we're leaving the shop right now. Um, I will explain everything later. Run smooth already. Right off the bat. Six hundred. Uh, <laughs> about like five eighty. I gotta upgrade my turbo. Huh? I gotta upgrade my turbo. It made like five eighty. What size is the turbo? Sixty-two, sixty-six. Not the, the exhaust. But the uh, the exhaust housing is a little small. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right, bro. Take care. Um, yeah, so I gotta I gotta upgrade my uh, exhaust housing because it's a little too small. Um, so we'll be back. But it made rough. It was like 580. It was like 570 ish. This is gonna be the first drive in this car, guys. Um, again, we should probably angle this one. We didn't make what we wanted to, but it's all good because the reason why we didn't make it does make sense. Bro, this is this is literally my this is the fastest car that I've ever been in. And it's my car. Running. Running, yeah. Alright. Isn't it crazy how it's just that fast? straight up with you guys i do actually want a z i want a 370z a nismo to be exact but i know those are like really expensive right now that is literally a 370z nismo oh, this thing is so clean i'll give you guys a hint on the next the next car okay the car is a six speed manual transmission the biggest hint is i'll be able to boost that car and make almost twice the power that this car makes on a mustang dyno on a stock engine. The car that we went with was a 2013 Nissan Lizzo. Let's go! And uh, I can tell you guys right now, just, just being honest with you, my main goal for this car is to turbocharge it. Like, that's literally like one of the reasons why I wanted this car so bad is because of the fact that you can literally boost this car and on a stock engine make about 600 horsepower. The boy bought single turbo kit for the Nismo. You guys know I've been talking about this for almost a year. Wow. Wow. Man, I wish you guys could feel this because my stomach. Wow, bro. <laughs> that, and it felt smooth, huh? Yeah.
So we are going to fill this car up because we are going out to eat with the boys tonight to Monterey uh, for Daniel's birthday. So we're going to fill this car up on its first tank of E85 real quick. Guys, look how expensive E85 is here. Look how, look how expensive E85 is here. That's absolutely insane. I think I got E85 for this car for Tunde for like $3. Out here in the Bay Area, it's like $5.30. That's insane. And here goes its first tank of E. My first time ever filling up with... Hey, hey, what? Stuck on the first time filming for E without having to worry about stopping it because I'm not on full E. Wow, that pump looks good on this car. <laughs> Alright, guys, so we figured something out. So we're on our way home right now. We just got gas. Um, we're heading home because we got, like I told you guys, we have dinner tonight at 8 in Monterey. I was reading over Monsef's email. Long story short, that first reaction that we did for you guys was inaccurate because that was low boost low boost is 10 psi high boost is 15 psi so we're gonna redo it so let's see let me uh let me get past this pump right here actually that's actually i don't know why i haven't fixed that yet that's a pretty bad hump all right so we're gonna we're gonna do this right now so we're gonna hold cancel down all right so this is high boost ready Oh, damn, hella fast, right? No, that's not it. 
Look this thing has a Magic monster, bro. bro. What? Wait, I wonder why you left us alone first. Probably for this reason. Oh, these fools think they're going to be doing something. They figure it out. To get to somewhere safe right here because we're kind of on the side of the road and there's like semis. That's not gonna go in, bro. You gotta loosen it. You smell that sweet, sweet, sweet heat. All right, uh, so <clears throat> we're gonna do low boost because so it's funny because after we got done, long term short, we got done because no. there's two maps there's low boost and high boost. Low boost meaning uh. It's, it's uh, 10 psi and high boost is 15 psi. And you know, the, the more psi you push, the more power you're pushing. So we're we're driving around thinking that you know we're on high boost, and this whole time we're on low boost. Oh really? Yeah. So then on our way home, we hit high boost and we blew a charge pipe off. So we had to pull what? off. Yeah, that's how that's how like dramatic the change was. So we had to pull over and put the uh, charge pipe back on. But yeah, no, oh, it just popped off. Yeah, it just popped off. Okay. This is like a couple of, you know, the one that goes with auto body. Yeah. Yeah. So they had to pop that one. Oh, wow. Um, I shouldn't have went this Sounds way. Sounds awesome, though, man. Yeah. Wow. I'm going to go this way. Because that road's terrible. The clutch is not that easy to drive. Oh, that's right. You got the clutch. Yeah. You got a lot of new stuff. Yeah, pretty much everything's new. It is. I was thinking about it. I was like, man, there's so many different. Um, Components, things, yeah, components yeah. that you have purchased and put on and installed. So yeah. I can't even keep up with it. I'm gonna go because she's gonna be on her way. Alright, All right, you ready? Yeah. This is low boost. Yeah, 
exhaust housing is uh, too small. So in order to fix that, we have to upgrade the exhaust housing. Wow. It has to be a little bit bigger, yeah. Oh wow. Yeah, it's not not a it's not a huge deal. I'm so happy with the way it turned out. I'm just I'm grateful, forever grateful for the fact that we went to the dyno and we were able to get it done with little to no problems. Yeah. You know? There was one problem where not that wasn't really a problem though. There's the one um, issue that we had to fix. Right. But it took like 10, 15 minutes. It wasn't a big deal. Uh, but I'm just grateful that the fact that you know everything smooth and stuff. So. Yeah, we were talking about how uh, how excited we were and uh, impressed that you know you and you and Chris helping you did the whole thing. Yeah. I mean from ground zero. Yeah. You know, it's not like you know you had gone to school or you've done it like a thousand times over and over yeah. it's like you did it one time and one time only yeah right yeah. now that that's awesome because yeah. there's a lot to it you know it's not just the turbo there's yeah. so many different components that you know i can't even i don't even have a list Turn down, nah, 